In today's Madden 18 tip, we're going to be taking a look at how to beat cover four in Madden 18. This is one of the most popular defenses that you're going to face. It's one of my personal favorites as well. Any cover four, it does a really good job against the run. It also does a good job against the more popular corner route. So we're going to be taking a look at how to beat cover four. But before we do that, I want to introduce myself and welcome those of you that are new. My name is Cody. And for those of you guys that this is your first time checking out my YouTube channel, I want to encourage you just to watch the entire video. And at the end of the video, let me know in the comments number one what is your name so that i can meet you and number two what do you think of the video and what can we do to help you in madden 18 all right so let's take a look here this is a quick little play here that will help you beat uh cover four in madden 18 now this comes from the shotgun empty bunch and we're going to show you how to beat cover four let's just use the nickel 35 because that's personally my favorite cover four in the game and the play that we're going to be using, we're going to actually come out in the play divide wheel, but we're going to audible to the play vertical. So when you use the gun empty bunch, and this is a critical point for everybody to understand, you don't want to come out in a play that you can have at your disposal in the quick audible. So we're going to call the play divide wheel, and we're going to audible to the play verticals. All right, so they're going to play cover four. And what we're going to do with this play is we are going to motion Des Bryant to the left side of the line of scrimmage. And as you can see here, one other adjustment I like to make on this is I like to put Terrence Williams on a smart routed out route. Now your first read, and this is what's gonna help you beat cover four, is just a quick no pass lead throw to Des Bryant. Now what you wanna do there, I threw it a little bit too early because I already knew where I was going. Uh, when you get in the middle of a game, you're gonna be able to you know, kind of have better timing with this. But basically again, motion Des to the outside. And what you're gonna see happen is you're going to look to him, and if he's open, no pat, no bullet pass lead, and you want to go ahead and click the possession catch. So, uh, pretty simple little play here, but what it is, is it's a really, really good play against number one, cover four, number two, cover three. Uh, and even if they go, if they go press, press coverage like this, uh, which is kind of a way to combat against this, then what you're going to see is you're still going to be able to, um, you're, you're still going to be able to hit this read here. Let me show you real quick. Uh, what we can do so if they go press coverage in that situation where they go something like this then you're going to have um you're going to have this vertical place still open and uh, what you're going to actually have open now is ezekiel elliott's route so des is going to be covered but zeke is going to be open up the seam uh never mind forget about that sorry i thought he would be open um let me show you one other thing you can do on this play to uh work against a press cover four this actually is a lot better but if they do press up another thing that you can do is you can you can leave terrence williams on the streak or fade and if they press coverage you can bomb them to the outside if, as long as you get time in the pocket so let me show you one more time here so in this scenario we wouldn't put terrence williams on the smart run out route and i always suggest that anyway is if they press coverage, you don't want to run smart routed out routes. What you want to do is if they press coverage, that's where you want to kind of stretch them vertically. So we're going to try to leave him on that streak, and we're just going to lob it up. And as you can see, he's going to outrun most people. It's going to be a nice one-on-one -on -one animation for you. Normally, this will work well, especially if you have a little bit more space. One other thing, though, with this read is that if they go press, which is this is also – and obviously the best way to run this cover four is to run it from a press alignment. One other thing you can do is you can pass lead Des Bryant to the outside. So far to the outside and you're just going to, um, dang it, screwed up the, uh, screwed up the aggressive catch. It's a user catch that you can do, uh, with this read here. So again, it's easiest if they don't press coverage. Normally, they're not going to out of a cover four. And if they do press coverage, you're going to have that streak on that far right side of Terrence Williams that you can hit. But worst case scenario, you pass lead this thing to the left side. I can't get the user catch to work quite right. But normally, you'll be able to user catch this read. Another thing you can do is if they go press coverage, you can put Ezekiel Elliott on an out route. And this little out route right here will also be wide open against the cover four because he's playing a deep cover flat. So you'll hit that, that quick little out route pattern. The other thing that this is going to allow you to do, and one other, one other final uh, takeaway, is if they run cover four and they press, and you know, you know more than likely it's probably cover four, you, you know that, then what you can do is stay in this divide wheel play, and you can motion Des to the outside just like you would in verticals, 
and he's going to get wide open. That that route right there can only be stopped by Tampa 2. It can only be stopped by Tampa 2. So there's a couple of different things that you can do when they go press coverage. The problem, and obviously this is the best way to run cover four, is if they do go press coverage, you will be able to hit Terrence Williams deep more than likely. And also you're going to have this out route to Des Bryant when he cuts to the outside. You just click the possess and catch. So that's there's two kind of twofold things you can do. Um, another thing I really like out of the gun empty bunch is the quarterback draw. And I could talk about the gun empty bunch for days. Uh, but if you guys want to check out more about the gun empty bunch, what I'm going to encourage you to do is check out our premium membership. If you guys don't know what the premium membership is, in a nutshell, here's what it is. The premium membership is a exclusive all access pass to all of my content. And what it gives you is it gives you six ebooks, three on offense, three on defense. Right now we have two out and we have another one coming soon. We also give you a one hour update video each week. This week's video is going to come out probably on Friday and it's going to be all about the nickel 35 odd formation. But next week's video is going to be the gun empty bunch and that's probably going to come out on Monday. So be on the lookout for that, but you can get that premium membership by clicking the link below in the description. It's going to give you an all access pass so far. I haven't heard anything negative about it. So be sure to check out that premium membership. The updates are probably the best way to go about it uh, right now. I know we have a game in there where I kind of showed and broke down some of the different tactics and strategies that I was using with the current scheme that we developed. But anyways, guys, just want to encourage you to check out that premium membership for more details, more depth, because we're going to get really, really serious with this gun empty bunch obviously the verticals in my opinion if they're backed off coverage this little route right here is money they can't stop it there's absolutely nothing they can do when they're backed off if they're in a cover four to stop that now when they go press coverage it does make it a little trickier as you guys saw but one of the things i'm going to encourage you to do is call divide wheel and just run that route to des bryant that quick out is going to be phenomenal for you so anyways guys want to encourage you to check out that premium membership and reminder to those of you guys this is your first time watching one of my videos be sure to leave me a comment in the description that way i can just meet you just want to look forward to 